Welcome to Dust Off the Bricks. So we've got four of the advent calendars here. We've got the Marvel, Star Wars, Friends, and City. I did not pick up Harry Potter this year. I didn't really see any good minifigures or parts or anything like that. So I just didn't end up picking it up this year. So, uh, but let's just go through each day and what everybody got each day. So, for the Marvel one, you got Iron Man, a little jet, a gold pack of web pieces, which later on gets used in this one. You can see one web piece here and the other web piece is stuck in the box. This year is kind of weird cardboard, but then you got a snowman with like guns on the side. You got a little like gift wrapping station. You get Black Widow with a Christmas sweater. So that's the cool one. And you get this like reindeer looking thing. Get um, Spider-Man with a sweater. Get Captain America. Get this jetpack thing. And you get this um, fireplace with Thor's hammer above it. You get like a workbench or something. Then over here, I can't remember her name, but you get her and she is supposed to be playing all the stuff for hockey is supposed to be go, go on her. So it's weird how they did these ones where you get, here's another example coming up. So I don't know what this is supposed to be. Then you get like a throne for Loki, I'm guessing. Then you get just a cape. That's all you got. Um, then you got Doctor Strange. So the cape and Doctor Strange, there's another one. This one and all the hockey stuff. This one came with this stuff. I'm guessing this jetpack probably goes with Captain America or something. Then you get whatever this is supposed to be. Then um, I think, oh, and it comes with the apple. Then you get a little train. Then you get a table set up. Then you get, oh, I can't remember his name as well, but he has the, uh, I can't remember what that cube is called. Then you get like an Iron Man sh big shield or landing platform or something. Then a very interesting, you could have added four more pieces of that to make it look like a good tree, but nope, that's it. That's the tree with a plain top. You could just add a cone on top. It would look great. But all right, now let's move on to S Star Wars. The Star Wars one is very much indoor based, um, but not heavy on minifigures. So the Marvel one, you get what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven minifigures. This one you get four, five, and a droid. So I guess I guess if you count the droid, it is a six. But I don't know. I feel like it could have been a little bit better. And indoors, one of my favorite parts of Star Wars. So I wish they did a little bit better on this. But you get I can't remember his name, but he's on a little sled, micro star, a uh, micro, a uh, Star Warship, micro Star Warship, a little weird, interesting droid, micro build. Um, clone Trooper, which is going to be perfect because I'm going to start uh, build a clone army here soon, hopefully. Then a micro build. And then a droid. Then a little a droid um, ship, which is weird because this is not indoor based. But then you get a micro build of the droid ship or the... Um, I can't remember what they're called right now. Then you get another micro build. Then this... I don't know what this is supposed to be. I think it's supposed to be a droid, but they put made it look like an, uh, a reindeer. Then you get a micro build. You get uh, Leia. You get um, Ewok Village, which is a set that I really hope to get someday, but in micro scale. So you get another micro build. Micro build. A speeder bike micro build, which is awesome. Then you get... Another micro build of a satellite. Then Darth Sidious with the Christmas sweater, which is awesome. Then Darth Sidious' throne. Micro build. An Ewok little glider thing. And then the reason I got the set, which is for the Christmas Ewok. Freaking awesome. I love Ewoks. So getting a little micro or a little Christmas one is just amazing. And I love the Leia. Indoor Leia. Awesome. All right, now off to the Friends one. I think I just have to set up one minifigure here. I think all the other ones, I think they only came with two um, minifigures. So this one's kind of really lame. But you get a lot of big pieces, but interesting pieces. So um, let's start off. You get Autumn. You get a little 
Christmassy thing. Then you get a dog, which I think this dog has... Okay, yeah, it doesn't have any special printing on it. Then a dog house. Grumpy cat. Um, but it has a, like, Christmas like wreath over the eyes. So that's a custom printed just for this, I'm guessing. Then you get this dog, which is, I think, just a generic uh, one of the dogs. Then over here, you get the lizard on some salad. It's just leaves, but then a dog trick thing. But this is the thing. This one or this one was supposed to be a snowman. And I didn't get not get the snowman, but they messed up and gave me two of the same dogs. But then you get another dog trick thing, park, dog park trick thing there. You get, um, I can't remember her name, but with a snowball. Christmas tree, way better than the, a Marvel Christmas tree, may I say. Then you get this, which is, I think this is stupid. So it's just like, oh, hey, load it up with a bunch of random dot pieces. So like, they're just trying to get rid of their dots, I'm guessing. Cat with a little Christmas uh, bow tie. Fireplace with a, a dog treat in a pan. A table. Um, all sorts of things to feed your dogs with. So you get like a hamster water dish there, lettuce for the lizard, meat for the dogs, carrots for the rabbit, sausage for the dogs. I don't know what that's supposed to be. And then a water dish and bowl for the dogs. And you get this dog with like Christmas sunglasses on or something like that. It's pretty interesting there. And you get two presents, the bunny, which I think is just a generic mold. And then for the next three days, you get this little Christmas train that you can attach. So I kind of think that's cool. But then for last, you get this little dog with a little reindeer, green reindeer thing. So that's pretty cool. All right, next is the city. All right, for the first day, you just get a snowman with skis, which is cool to get ski things because I do want to do like a ski hill next year in a winter village. So having some skis is kind of nice. Then you get like, get like Santa Claus is this way. You get a brick built reindeer hockey player, which is I think is pretty awesome. I, wife's family is really into hockey so getting a hockey player I think is pretty awesome then you get uh, a hockey goal I don't know what that's supposed to be it's very interesting a little ice sculpture I'm guessing the lady that did the ice sculpture some uh street lights a caroler which I think is pretty good minifigure to have then you get a little fireplace a gamer don't understand that much but then you also get the gamer table which I don't know. I don't know what why they did that. But then they oh, and then a gamer's chair. So you get the gamer's chair, gamer desk, and gamer on one. Then you get some person with a cell phone. Pretty cool skirt piece though. Then you get a cat on a table, maybe a micro Christmas tree. A grandfather clock, Christmas tree. Still better than the Christmas tree that we got in the Marvel series. We got a bunch of presents. We got a table with the turkey. Got a dog, a chihuahua, which is awesome. Because I lost my chihuahua from this last CMF series. Uh, the white one. I don't know where it went, but don't have one anymore. So I'm hoping to try to find one, a white one. But at least now I have a brown one. Uh, Mrs. Claus snowboarding. A sled. And something that can attach the sled for all the presents. And like always, we get a Santa Claus for day 24. So these are the four of the advent calendars. Let me know what you think. Obviously, and they're pretty overpriced for the price per piece too. So I don't know. I, I honestly got a couple of them just for part of the pieces. And I like the animals that come in the city one. They're usually somewhat unique. And the friends one, pretty unique molded animals. I'm trying to get a good collection of molded animals because I'm going to try to do a molded animal video every year and with and each time I'm going to have more mold animals. So, yeah. And then the Star Wars one got it because of the Ewok. Marvel one. Don't know why I picked it up. Didn't even know I picked it up until I grabbed it on January or on uh, December 1st. I was like, oh, I did get the Marvel one. But, yeah, those are the four admin calendars I got. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.